what would go in line with cars? If we were doing lateral, lateral thinking, what would we put there as other modes of transport? Okay, so we had plane, bike, train, bus. Okay. We move up and we say, what do we get by having a car? Okay, transport. What do we get from transport? Okay, mobility, independence. <laughs> and if we had to chunk that all the way up, you're right, we could end up with something like freedom or happiness. Chunk down. Give me a kind of car. VW. Kind of VW? Golf. golf. Kind of golf? Okay, we'll go straight to color. Okay, red and interior. Leather. Okay. Anyone not want freedom or independence? Anyone not want mobility? Anyone not want transport? Anyone not want a car? At this point, we're usually all still in agreement that these things are important to us. It's when we start moving down here where our specific ways um, of getting around via vehicle could start to change. Our color preference could be different. Our model could be different. Our make could be different. So if you're finding that you're reaching a point where you've got a stalemate and you're not agreeing on things, remember to chunk up. How do you chunk up? How do you get to a higher level of abstraction? How do you move from specific into general? Best question is why. Help me understand why that's important to you. Why do you want that option? And then when they tell you, I want it because of this, then you can say, okay, and then why is that so important? Or how does that fit in with your strategy or plan? And you move up a level. So you look behind it. You never ever attack another person's position or want. You look behind it to what their interests are, what their needs are, and you might find another way of meeting those, those needs. Mm -hmm.